Ooh. Oh man. Hello, frog fleshies. I'm Winter, and this is the Corrupt Kingdom. So I have moved my base down here, and. After I decided I'd be here, I realized just how, unco how uncomfortable it is to have your base encased in bedrock because you can't dig through anything. But listen, an enchanting table with all the, the, like, the bookshelves around was just a pain. I couldn't put it centered, I couldn't put it on the ground, I couldn't put it on the wall. It was just horrible that I was like, I don't care. And then I just left it like that. I hope uh, being on bedrock won't mess with my spawn point, but I don't think it will hopefully that would be terrible otherwise yeah i brought everything i had down here uh i should actually oh come back cool i need you let's say i don't need dirt on me i may have needs of some cobble and some of this i have one arrow i have no need to bring the ender pearl for now but i will take the flint and steel the axe will soon need to be remade and I will soon need to cut down more trees, but that's not going to be a problem. So I guess we can go on some adventure, although... I uh, I know I said last time that I wanted to go in the question mark place, but then I realized that this is probably supposed to be the last place I go to. So instead, I might as well finish exploring this place before heading towards the last three places. Plus... There's a, uh, well, I don't know, I, hmm, I was going to say that there was a chance that it was a wool in this air because of just how ridiculously big it is, but I have my doubts because I, if I counted correctly, I'm missing three wools, so that would be one over there, one over there, and one over there, so, uh, yeah. But anyways, I do want to check out that little area over there. It's kind of isolated from everything else. That area over there, see, we're below the part that we explored the last time. And there's still stuff up there to do too. So there's a bridge. Is there any way for me? Seems like the safest way to get where the house is, is to drop from up there. So I might as well do that. Okay, so this is the place. I tried to get some extra wood on my way here and my axe broke. <laughs> I should have gotten another one. That sheep. Sheep, don't do it. Sheep, no. Don't. Alright, let's take a look down here. Careful, 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 careful. Ooh, that was cool. There are cows. There are two iron... A mushroom. A villager. Ah, there's so much stuff, it's beautiful. Watermelons and wheat and, and, hey, hey, bookshelves. Matty and something, something. Hmm, three beds. This looks normal enough. Ooh, free food. Let's see, uh, this jungle wood, interesting, a little Mr. Iron golems, what's going on? Oh yeah, this is the infinite, uh, infinite mushroom stew source. Yeah, you. That's weird, alright. You. Hello! Ah, uh, You just don't want any of... You just don't... You don't want any... You don't... He's, he's ignoring me entirely, I'm like, nope. No trading with you. I'm done. <laughs> Well, is there anything else? Mm, I have the possibility to heal another villager and uh, bring him down here. Even though the bring him down here part is going to be very annoying. Wait, there are two villagers! Hey, you! Hi! Oh, you want chicken? You want chicken? I can't give you chicken. I like to have chicken myself. There is some chickens. I, I think I heard the chicken uh, back there at the intersection. Oh, this is the kind of uh, log that you can't get uh, legitimately in survival. See, all sides are the bark part of it. That's cool. 
Nom 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 nom. There really wasn't much here that I was interested in too. There is uh, the remains of uh, a squid. Let's not punch the villagers no matter what happens. There's a cow. Do I have any need for any of this? Can make some extra books, I suppose, from the cows and the sugar. But uh, yeah, I don't really feel like I need anything from here. Unless I get potions, I'll gladly come and steal some of the some of the melons. So yeah, it was just this this I could make the villagers breed and make a whole villager farm. Oh, oh, and get the emerald block by trading with the other villagers. I can trade wheat and leather. Hmm. I'm not sure if this is how I'm supposed to get the emerald block, actually. The emerald block had a... Oh! Okay, uh, hmm, I just remembered something that, uh, yeah, there is, uh, there are three wolves that I'm missing. Why is there an extra dirt block? Oh, that's an enderman that probably moved it. <laughs> that's funny. Uh, what was I going to say? There is an extra block, if you remember back in the first episode of this, which was nine months ago. <laughs> There is an extra block that can be acquired besides the metal blocks. And is there something there? Maybe. Besides the metal blocks and the walls for the monument, which is the emerald block, which had a hint to find it. And the hint was three question marks. So the emerald block could be over there. Am I facing the right way yet? Yeah, is the. Whoa! This is the bedrock tunnel where I set up my base and if the error block is over there I wonder if that means that the wall is not uh, in that direction because if it isn't uh, then it's over here and then there is indeed a wall that I'm supposed to find here I'm not really sure what's the case I'm out of uh, torches I'm making too many let's have only there less than a stack uh, I'm not really sure what is expected of me if I'm supposed to well, I, I I guess at least the hint now makes sense. Like the, the hint was telling me which area the emerald block is, so uh, I'm probably not. <coughs> Ow. I'm probably not supposed. To, hello, to use the villagers for that. Let's put some light up here. Now oh, this was redundant. Let's keep exploring in the meantime. Uh oh. Well. <laughs> We have squids! <laughs> Hi there, squid! I see you're stuck. Need a hand? Oh, there is a chicken I need over there. Oh, is that zombie holding an egg? It is, it's totally holding an egg. Oh, that's cool. Now that zombie is going to be there forever just holding this egg and being like, what am I supposed to do with this? Doesn't look like there's anything else but cows. Yeah, I'm not seeing anything else. That tree has clearly a hole right in the middle of uh, its leaves. That's definitely... that is something that I should check out. Pretty sure there is a water pool somewhere that kind of leads downward. No? No lava pool? You sure? Well then I suppose... Fine... I'll give it a second to reach all the way down. We should not have done there. Is there anything I'm going to wash away? I hope not. That would be sad. Right, is there anything dangerous over there? Uh, not as long as it's daytime. Whee! The leaves sh should totally break or fall. What? Late splashing sound? <laughs> right, here's the hole and aha! There is absolutely nothing here. Well, 
god, it's very lame. Oh, -ho, creeper, oh, spider. And a skeleton somewhere. Ah, right there, actually. Ne ne wait a second. No! I must not approach the end of... Uh, yeah, the edge of this island, because that's going to just destroy me. Why are the mobs not facing me today? <laughs> they're all looking away from me, even as they're trying to kill me. And just not worth of... Ooh, this is something. This is definitely something. That's cool. We need to check it out. Uh, meanwhile, I'll just pick up this free wood. This is definitely my favorite area, at least that is uh, aesthetically. <laughs> I really like the way it looks. Also, I feel, I feel like it kind of uh, it it would work as a starting area, except maybe n but without the void below. Although any fall from any of these trees would kill you anyways, but uh, uh, with trees and water and the animals, it feels like it would be a really good starting area. I also get some extra water from that, and yeah, that's cool. Did it come from down below? The world below? The world that people do not believe exists? Or did it just come from this shadow? Or probably just from the shadow. I'm already out of charcoal. That's why I need more wood. I need to burn... Great amounts of wood. I use up lots of wood. That's what I eat for breakfast. Right. What's that? Oh, it's a <laughs> experience orb. Okay. It will not try to kill me. Time to head down here. Wait, where was the entrance to here? Let me walk around this. Okay. What's the easiest way to get down? Big block. Dig another block, take a look. One more block to dig and then start making a staircase down. Boop, beautiful. Hello! This goes both upward and downward. Maybe it will not actually lead anywhere. Maybe it's going to be a single chest, but this doesn't smell like a uh, fleecy box. Because they have a specific smell. Ooh, pretty. Pretty. Wait, maybe that is the hole I was looking down from earlier? Oh, that's possible, actually. Yep. Now, is this a spawner I'm hearing or just a bunch of zombies? And again, how do I get down? I do have water. Will make it a bit difficult, though, to place torches. Also, moving up and down a water stream is not exactly the best. I guess it can, it can work. Oh, hello! I see you over there. You're wearing fancy things. It's a shame you can't take me from down there. It's a shame for you. Uh, hi there. Skeleton's already hit shooting at me. I can't see the skeleton. I totally am having issues seeing anything from here. Oh, 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 Alright, there's a skeleton. Skeleton down. Seems... seems safe. I see a couple of zombies over there. Make sure that it's well lit. Is this a hole? No, it's not. It doesn't lead to the void. Hi there! I could heal you, but I will not. Also, I could burn you, but I don't want to burn you. Again, because I... I know what happened to the ship. <laughs> Some time ago, but it, that was an accident. That was an accident. It was an accident. An accident. Accident. Have you caught on fire yet? Could you please catch on fire? I want the wood to catch on fire. If only I had the still, damn it. Are you going to catch on fire? This is not going to be cool if you don't catch on fire. Damn it. There we go! Finally! Yes! Burn down! That was an accident. Uh, I really like this area. I really don't want to burn it down, even though with. Uh, the way I cut down some of the trees for the logs. <laughs> I didn't exactly preserve uh, the beauty of the place. This is the part where the void changes color for whatever reason. So this only led me to a bridge. Which kind of sucks because I could have reached any of the other areas just the same way I have reached this one. Which... I can't... there we go. Yeah, if anything shoots at me from here, I'm dead. Um, 
I'm really afraid of these bridges. Still, I could have simply placed the blocks or put down water to, to make my way over there. So, I'm not happy that the tree only led to this. I will skip the building part and bring you back for this instead. This bridge looks way better. I like this bridge. Beautiful bridge. All bridges should be like that. That makes me happy. Well, this was completely unproductive. Time to go back. I believe I am ready to explore the next uh, area. Cause I don't... it doesn't look like there's anything else up there. Though I, I haven't really explored too much, but I just... I just feel like... Uh, there's nothing else up there, cause this is... This would break the flaw if one wool was here, because suddenly there's two areas with a wool in a row instead of being separated by an intersection, that would be weird. So I'm assuming the design is usual and the next wools are going to be one there, one there and one there. And the emerald block is probably there with one wool too. Now I just have to decide whether I want to go to the Atlantis of the Sands or the Flyer Mountain, because I've already decided this area is going to be... The last one. I guess I can go in a snowy place. That would uh, make for a... Wait, uh, this could very be dangerous. I do not have blocks on my bar. First, let's take a look. This is dirt below. And this is wood. Why? Ah. Okay, so the void is directly below me and that actually worries me a bit. I think I'll keep on digging and I'm being afraid. I am not afraid of snow in this map. What are you talking about? Snow. Is there any trap I can trigger by just walking? That would be only something that usually Vex would do. Ah... Uh, Snow can't hide anything, right? A snow block below that? No. That would be something like a spawner nearby and only one spot for a mob to spawn, which would be... which would have a pressure bullet or something that would trigger redstone and make me fall. Can't think of anything else. I would be much more calm if it was bedrock below me, but that is ice. Ooh. Definitely, definitely, most beautiful layers have been kept for last. I'm so glad I, I, I'm so glad I have this render distance. Although right now I kind of wish even to have a, a much uh, one that goes even further away. Let's see, can I make more blocks this way? I can use them as building blocks, I suppose. All right, let's make our descent. We have to find an obvious place where the that where I would be supposed to go that's probably the highest uh, uh the highest mountain probably on top of that this area is so big I can't even see the borders around it this is really beautiful and I'm happy it's in a in an open area so during daytime it's going to be much easier to navigate hmm that water oh this is made of cobble I thought it was made of ice and then that happens. Aliens! <laughs> uh, nothing new, nothing new. Just cobblestone, which is awesome actually, because I kind of wanted. Ah! Well, that's not normal cobblestone! Never mind! <laughs> I was just going to say that uh, I needed to make another cobble generator on my new base. And that is, that's actually a problem because I can't uh, put it in the walls because everything is bedrock uh, where I put my bed the last time, so it, it's it's a mess. I'm not sure where exactly I could put a cobble generator. I'd have to make it really compact and uh, make sure it's in the spot. Uh, you're there. Where it's not going to burn my bookshelves. So, well, let's not hit you anywhere close to those blocks, huh? I think this is far enough away. Yep. Last time the we had to deal with silver fishes in this map, it was not a problem at all. 
I was actually trying to make a building disintegrate be before beneath my feet, but it didn't work. Maybe there weren't enough silver fishes, but all of this, uh, every single block here has silver fish in it, I'd say. Yep, yep, silver fish is everywhere. Oh man, I may not have brought enough potatoes for this. Mm, yeah, yeah, wait, I need to be holding this as I climb. <laughs> the Olympic torch. I'm going to light the stuff up. Wait. There is a hole here. Wait, no, no, that's... I take it back. There is ice here. You can't see ice through water. And you can't see water through ice. Or you can't see more ice behind ice. Because that's how Minecraft handles opacity. And there's a hole here. Ah. Ah. Well, at least I know there's not going to be a dragon on top of this mountain. Yeah. Ah, uh, I guess I'll bring you guys back when I see something interesting. That's my own torch, isn't it? And now the paranoia kicks in. Well, I have reached the top of something. Did I go too much to the right? Where am I supposed to go? Well, there's a sign over there. Please don't say something to the effect of you went, ah, ah, that was the... <laughs> <laughs> wow, that's the limit of the map. Uh, that actually kind of scared me. So there is a sign. I sure hope it doesn't say something like uh, you went the wrong way, turn back and go back and or something really mean. Alright, let's make sure nothing's going to surprise me. What? Well, last time a sign told me to jump and I didn't. It turned out it was exactly what I was supposed to do. This is where I placed a torch. Why is the sign facing this way anyways? I'm supposed to come from over there. So wouldn't the sign have to be facing this way? Or maybe it's because it's telling me to jump back where I came from? slightly confused almost tight limit all right do I do the stupid thing or do I do the thing uh, that I have no clue if it's going to work uh, as in do I follow the science uh, uh, suggestion and try to go back down the mountain by going staying exactly on this line here or do I keep going beyond the mountain You can't tell me what to do, sign, and yet I'll keep, I'll obey you. Aw, oh, please don't be trolling me, that would be so annoying. I don't see anything directly here. Those are torches I placed. Hmm, feather falling in would help. I think protection helps. I think my, the durability of my armor is going down, though. Does anybody see? Oh! Oh, duh! Yep, that's where we're supposed to go. I was sure I had placed a torch around here. Did I? No, I didn't. There is no torch of mine here. I hadn't started placing torches at this point. Well, I should have totally been able to see this from... Uh, during the night. Uh, even from down there. Well, I will not be complaining, except if a zombie wielding a sword is going to ruin my day. Found a place! Why is there a hole here? For no reason. It looked like something where there would be some tripwire. But there wasn't. Oh, like that. Well... Hmm... Oh, I can't reach it though. Like this. Oh! I still got hit! <laughs> <laughs> there, there, <laughs> being like, ha, your, <laughs> your traps cannot get me, I am too smart, and then I still get hit. Where did it come from anyways? Where did it come from? Ah, I forgot. Hmm, well, is this going to be a problem? I need to be away. There's no way I can be away from... Up, uh, yeah, no, I need to escape back down because otherwise it's so fishies. 
We had some issues that can die to fall damage though. Follow me! <laughs> Why do I hear stuff burning? Yeah, I hear stuff burning. Huh. Wonder if I can take a peek somewhere or if I totally there I totally is bedrock. Oh! Oh man! I have an idea! This time... Oh, I didn't notice that uh, cross thing over there. This time I, cre I came prepared. So first of all, do not... Uh, well, that was completely unnecessary. Do not break stone, including this one. And do not step on the pressure plate. Oh, that that was in a pressure plate. <laughs> Oops. Well, great. Now I have trapped myself in here with a silly fish. <laughs> Leave me alone. Leave me alone. Ah. Gosh darn it. <laughs> Help. <laughs> let me out. <laughs> no, seriously. Let me go. Please. Please. Oh gosh darn it. Okay, that didn't make any more sewer fishes appear, luckily. How did I even get in here? Don't break blocks. <laughs> Do not break blocks. Hello. Oh no, not you. No, you even have a potion effect. What does it mean? What do you have? Are you... If you can't be killed, I'm going to be really mad. Alright, you can be killed. That's cool. That's great. Did I not fix the arrow glitch? I'm sure I have. I am positive I did. Yes, I did. Okay, good. <laughs> For once, I remembered. So there is spawners here that are going to absolutely, utterly destroy Remade Day. Hmm? Zombies have potion effects too. Is it something like... It can't be... Regen, because it wouldn't work on the zombies. It's it's red. Uh, I don't know. Nee, yeah, but I don't want to use up my. Ah, ah, I heard it! I heard it! <laughs> Go away, please! I want a boomerang. <laughs> Just to keep you far away from me. And there's no digging, right? Why are zom zombies? Why are creepers spawning somewhere where they're then drowning? I wonder. But I'm absolutely terrified now that I've seen what I'm dealing with. Oh, oh, okay. There's a spawner there, and one here. One of them could be the creeper spawner. Just want to make sure that up there it's safe as well. If a single creeper spawns behind me, that's it, I'm doomed. Those creepers, you can't survive their blast. I haven't really seen what kind of spawner it was, but there's a charged creeper up there. Okay, what kind are you? You're a zombie one. That worries me, because now I really don't know where to find the creep charged creepers. Are they all on the walls? Up there? How can I be safe from them? Bridging here in the air? That's not safe at all. Can I get up there and take a look? Need more blocks. Yep, need more blocks. That's... I got some mussy cobble? Mussy. Let's get the pill. Take a look. Ah, there it is. This is a charged creeper spawner, no doubt. Now I want a hook. Uh, what's it called? I don't remember what it's called. The thing you aim it and you can climb on places. Alright. Now what's up here? I'm shifting for no reason. <laughs> Just walking a bit slower so I can take a better look around. No spawners up here for now. One there, one there, one there, one there, one there. Ah, 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 ah. Charged creeper spawned somewhere. I don't know where, but it's not up here. And I hope it's not uh, above me. 
No, it doesn't look like there's space for anything above me, assuming there's a room above me to get down where I am, through the water. There are spawners down here. That the spider cannot reach me. So I have a chance to put some light around. Okay, you're normal. I like you. And I wouldn't mind if you exploded. Oh, I kind of wanted to keep this a surprise, but opening the inventory, by opening the inventory, I kind of showed what I went uh, and did earlier. I got TNT because if you blow up, uh, if you blow up uh, silverfish blocks, uh, they will not uh, free some silverfishes. There is a chest and netherrack, uh, and the chest is good. The netherrack is not. Uh, wait, that's not netherrack. I think it's nether bricks. In any case, it's reddish purple. Oh, you have potion, right? Uh, takes a bit longer to kill you. Those are flames of a spawner. Wait, am I activating spawner from all the way up here? Oh, oh. Uh, these are nether brick fences. Alright. Uh, let's take it slowly. And light. Oh, I didn't place it. <laughs> Oh, okay, yes, yes indeed, there is a spawner over there, I'm activating it, um, mm, these are spawning faster than I can kill them, and I'm going to start regenerating in a moment, did I say start or stop, because I meant stop or whatever I said, alright, that's better, I also need to eat, oh, oh, nice, Yada! you were not expecting that, were you? Nom 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 It's getting night time or dawn, I can't tell. It's kinda cool. I like this place. Let's take care of these spawners that are going to... Ah! Oh, I'm stupid. <laughs> it's so difficult to play Minecraft when you can't mine blocks. If there was a game rule and I just couldn't manage to, I'd be fine. Oh, I walked in a circle, I see. But no, I dig them and then I grab them and then I find out... Oh, that's probably the fire I heard earlier from outside. Seems likely. And you're still around. Anyways, this is a great moment to use one of these. Let's hope to try... Let's try to get the silverfish too. By standing around here. Oh, I was hoping you'd die earlier. Okay, no more silverfishes appeared. This is... In this version of Minecraft, they do appear if you eat silverfish, right? Just, just making sure I'm not uh, doing a whole bunch of things for nothing. Alright, the blaze is over there. Wait, this is a blaze spawner, I think. No, it's not. Uh, more zombies. Oh, aren't you like you were born with a shovel? Well, the position of the shovel is kind of important, too. Luckily, like you were born with a shovel in your hands! So as I was saying, I, do, I wouldn't mind explosions because they kind of help me get around the problem of not being able... How many spawners? Okay, only one. To mine blocks, but still... Yeah, I, I do need to be careful with my armor. Can you please? Thank you. Oh, maybe that's fire resistance. No, that's orange. The only red pushing effect I can think of is the region. That's, that's red, isn't it? Hmm. You can tell I don't use region potions that often. Too much UHC. <laughs> oh no, the blade set you on fire. That's so sad. Ooh, I claim my smite sword would help, but I'm almost out of sword durability. This is not good. I will have to go back already. But at least we took a good look around, and we know we have to deal with blazes, zombies. I'd like to check out that chest. Silverfishes? I need to plant and grow more potatoes. Yeah, I do need to do a bit of preparation of camera. So I'm going to try and see if I can't reach that chest, although I doubt it. Okay, there, there are no blades. I can try. Let's run and already be too late. Wait, was that a cave spider? I, I did it. Oh, out of torches. Never mind, I'm leaving. See ya! That... It didn't look like a cave spider, I think. Shouldn't have been. Where did it come? This way. 
Time to leer! Ah! Oh yes! Cave spider! Cave spider! There are cave spiders! I don't want no cave spiders here. Oh yeah, I forgot how to touch this. Why is there snow here? Why did I just go there and break it without thinking? Ah! These guys followed me. Well, uh, I am now going to retreat back at my base and get stuff to be ready to face this place. Plus, I think I'll use the tw those 27 levels I've got. I need to make a turkey easier. Oh, charge creeper, let's leave. And then I will see you next time. So thanks so much for watching, I hope you enjoyed yourself. Next time, we'll try to see what's in the chest we saw earlier and get the wool possibly. <laughs> that would be great. Bye-bye!